Hey guys, and welcome back to some more Thieves of Minefield. So last time we did some railroad work, and we got it. We got it all the way over there. It's now connected and whatnot. It just may not make it to you know up the stairs of it because it doesn't really have enough power. But that's okay. So one thing I've been wondering why I've not been like I just kind of asked myself this. I was like, why have I not been doing this? Is like building more onto this area like I have this whole area to myself and I'm doing nothing with it I'm being all secretive about it when I don't have to be secretive about it when I'm the only one here <laughs> you know what I mean like I could easily put stuff out here now like there's no point of being secretive in this general area maybe the other areas yes um, my one of my other areas or one of the three areas I have is now gone so really I, oh no I have four areas Minus one because it got destroyed. So th three areas. <laughs> I had four. Now I have three. Um, but I could I could just really start building around here. Like that's what I'm gonna be doing now. I was thinking of a big project to do, and then I realized it was right in front of my face all the time. So I have all this cobblestone, all this freaking um, stone bricks, dirt, and jungle. Like I don't know what I was thinking this whole time, and I'm so happy I thought of it because it like. I don't, all of a sudden I just really want to start building some towers, some secretive, not secretive, stop saying secretive stuff, okay? Stop it. Jeez, so frustrating. Um, but anyways, besides me yelling at myself, um, actually I should probably put it right there, huh? That would make more sense. But making towers and like fence gates around this area would make it look so much nicer and worth living in. Right now I'm just in a dirt shack, like who wants to see that every episode? Not many people, so I'm just gonna put everything away that I don't need, which is pretty much everything here, except for the wood planks and um, the food and I don't need that stuff. Okay, I'm gonna keep the wood with me. Okay, there we go. And then I have my axe. I have my okay, good. I have all the necessary tools. Let me just get this stone bricks and all this cobble. I should probably make a lot of this cobble into um. Oh, there's some stone. Okay, good. I have a lot of cobble. Holy crap. When did I get all of this? I have no idea. I know I didn't steal it. I don't know why I'd want to steal cobble, but I should definitely... Okay, my mouse is like flipping the heck out. It's like twitching so fast. Okay, I think it's better. Oh, it's so slow now. I don't even get it. Okay, there's some more stone. Uh, let's put a few in there. Put you guys in there. go because I do like the stone okay, there we go let's leave the bricks there I guess these are all bricks then I don't think it's gonna be enough but that's okay there we go okay so let us get building onto our uh, first tower which I think I'll make it the biggest one I'm gonna have it up on top of I want to make a big plate thing right there, but I don't want it to be a tower. So I'm going to make my first tower up on top of this area over here when I make an awesome dive into... Perfect. Yup. Just too good. I'm just too good. You guys want to hear a story? Okay. Well, you guys have no choice. <laughs> you, have, <laughs> you have no say in it anyways. So I don't know why I even asked you, but I got a new iPhone. I got the iPhone 5S, and... um. Apparently, when I, myself, get a new phone, it always has to come broken. Because when I got it, at first I didn't really notice it, I just kind of thought, oh, it's turned off. Like, the vibrate modem thing was just turned off. And I started messing around with it, I was like, are you kidding me? This is broken? <laughs> the thing was broken. Like, the vibrate would not work. And um, usually when, when one thing's broken in the phone, several other things will follow. So I had to go to the Apple Store and like ask them to fix it or see what's wrong with it and they couldn't fix it and then the guy there that we went to um he is like one of those people that you walk up to and he like tells you that when your meeting is or who you're meeting with or where to stay to for them to find you and um i we go up to him and he's like 
okay, so what's wrong with it? And we're like, oh, the vibrate modem is broken. And he's like, wait, which phone is it? And we're like, the iPhone 5S. And he like, uh, I don't want to, I can't repeat exactly what he said because he swore. But due to the story, I think I should. Um, so excuse my language to the people that don't like me swearing. But he's like, shit, already? <laughs> I just started cracking up. It was like, the way he said it was so funny. It was like, uh, it was so, I, I thought that was like, it was early in the morning and that, that made my day. It was like, that made it worth coming to Apple store to get my phone fixed in the morning. But, um, it's just the way he's like, he was just totally amazed by how can we make a phone that already, that's totally new, that already broke. <laughs> uh, it's funny. Um, cause he was totally convinced it was, um, one of the older phones that it was and like I literally got the phone what, what what day is it okay today is Sunday when I'm recording this and we got the phone on Tuesday Wednesday oh wow yeah man it just was it never worked um, I just kind of ignored it at first until um, I told my my dad that it wasn't working and he said we probably should go get checked out and we did so yeah there's a great story for you guys I know it's really entertaining but um, yeah, oh well, phones break, I know there's, I'm, it's better than having a cracked screen, because if you guys don't know, I accidentally, my phone dropped out of my pocket when I was walking somehow, I stepped off of a curb, and I guess when I stepped off the curb, it bounced high enough to, um, bounce, it made my phone bounce high enough to break it, I don't, I don't, I don't really know how that works, but apparently it does. And that was frustrating. So, yeah. Um, last week was pretty... A very eventful week, though. Getting the new phone, and then getting the PS4, and then lot figure I can live stream, and now all... Oh, my... It just... Partnership with Polaris. Last week was just full of surprises. Good and bad. <laughs> but mostly good. I really enjoyed it. And hopefully, the Polaris will keep me going here. Um... I'm gonna try to get more involved with the uh, network, which is my main problem with TGN, is I just wasn't really part of anything. What was I gonna do? I totally forgot what I was gonna do. Oh, I was gonna make stairs. That's right. There we go, I just need like, let's just do 12, just to be safe. Cause I wanna make some cool sceneries on this one. Cause I feel like it's necessary to make it look cool. Otherwise it's just gonna be a stupid tower. That no one gives two craps about. This tower isn't very big, I just noticed, either. But that's okay. Um, okay. Just about the right amount. And I can just put these guys right here. Ooh, that looks actually quite nice. It's not really a tower. It's more of just like a scenery type. It looks really nice, though. I don't really want to make it a tower anymore. I changed my mind. I'm not making it a tower because of what I just made. I'm really proud of it. <laughs> okay. I need more than that. There we go. Okay, so now I just need to connect these. I don't I don't really need all that much, but um since I'm not gonna make it a full out tower, I could actually still make it a tower. I don't know. I really like how it's looking so far. I should get some glowstone up there and uh, put it in the middle. And light up the area, because we need to light up this place from stupid zombies. Okay, so I need to make do I have any? I do have dirt. See, it's always good to have dirt on you. You never know when it'll come in handy. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Let me. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Nice. I need to put some stuff right here. And um, now it looks kind of like one of those places that has a fountain in it. You just go in and you like just look in the fountain or something or like a. A well? I don't know. Just like a really secretive old place that I can't describe. Should I actually do this? Make it look a little bit nicer. Yeah, that looks a lot nicer. Okay, good. Experimenting is always good. Alright, nice. Um, I would like to do some work up top here, so let's just get this, and, uh, yeah, I should build my way, uh, I can always just make another crafting, no, I'll just take my crafting table with me, don't want to waste wood, you never know when you just need that one more piece of log 
then you're like, oh, that's right, I made it to a crafting table. Um, let's just put cobblestone down. Oh, yeah. Okay, let's use this. Okay. So, what should I do up here? I probably should do something like... Let's so put that guy down. There we go. Oh, that should be more than enough, I hope. So, I was wanting not to do that. Oh, please don't drop it. I want to put like more out here. Oh no! Please, God, let me do this successfully. There we go. Okay, so I guess I took that first one away, even though I didn't really need to. Oop. Nice. Three. Four. Five. Six. Okay. The crafting table actually looks kind of nice up here. I may just leave it. We'll call it crafters... Crafters... What What should I call this? Crafters Shrine! <gasps> Ooh, that look, that that's a good name. Crafters Shrine. How did I think of that? I don't even know. But I'm really proud of myself for thinking of that. Actually, I'm going to have to keep that there. We'll have to do this. I'm gonna get some water to go down through here. And uh, we've made a pretty epic shrine. Sweet, I like the cobble on the sides. Oh my goodness, I am just, I am just really doing good. I'm doing a great job right now. I'm really proud of myself. And I should get some torches down too. Where am I, oh, I put my torches away, I guess. All right, let's hurry down. Uh, actually, I'm gonna make a cut. This is something I usually don't do. I usually do all the running, but you know what? I'm gonna make a cut. Whoa, oh my God, I'm back. Oh, I forgot water. It's kind of a problem. Wow, how did I forget water? I just grabbed a bucket. I was like, you know what? The water will appear somewhere. <laughs> Darn it, how did I forget water? It's right there. I ran, I even jumped into it. Wow, that is embarrassing. I am really sorry. That's just, oh my gosh. Okay. Water. <laughs> the struggles of being me. <laughs> There's a freaking ocean right next to me. I run up a mountain and realize, oh, I f forgot the water. I only got like 30 freaking reminders right in front of my face. Oh, man. Okay, I'm sorry about that. But here we go. We need to finish this before another nightfall because I had to sleep again. And I really just don't want to deal with the zombies or anything. But um, let me lighten up the area. That's a good, good start to finishing this thing off. Because I really don't want zombies and stuff spawning up here. Just at heaps of mounts. And, uh... I just, I just don't want anything up here. <laughs> it's so annoying to have, like, zombies surrounding you at all times. It's like, just go away, please. You're not welcome. No one said you can come here. And I'm out. Crap. There we go. Okay. Oops. Not mean to put that one right next to each other. Um, okay. That was a big fall. Did not mean to do that. But okay. Let's get up there now and um, we'll finish this buddy off. There we go. Nice. Okay, so we gotta put it right there. Wow, that's actually really cool. And then I'm gonna get back up top, so we might have to do another few random cobblestone poles again. And then around this, you want to put glowstone. And that is gonna look epic. Now, I don't know if I wanna do the second thing I was thinking about. But I could put glowstone off the edge of this. Kind of do that like all the way around. Actually, that does look quite nice. I do like it. Crap, how am I going to get to that one? Huh? No. There we go. Sweet. 
And should I... How about I get rid of this? Oh, wow, that is great. Alright, let's look at it from a distance. Hmm. I feel like we should do more to the bottom here. More to the bottom. Okay. Make it look like it's going actually into the ground, you know? That's a piece of artwork. I'll have to fix that other side later. I don't have enough stone. Okay, I can do this part, though. See how far I get, I guess, and I can finish it next episode. Or um, if I have stone on me still, then I could see if I can finish it. Let's see if I have stone. Oh, I do. Oh, I do. Oh, perfect. Nice. Okay, I do have enough. Sweet. Just get it out of the way this episode. Um, there we go. Probably should have brought a shovel with me. I didn't honestly think I was gonna be digging this much though, but um, kind of have to. I want to make this look good. There we go. And now it actually looks a lot bigger than it really is, so that's cool. It gives it that, like... Uh, uh, what's the word? Illusion effect, I guess. You could say. Sweet. Alright, well, hopefully you guys enjoyed this episode, and if you did, be sure to leave those likes and comments. Subscribe to me today, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.